The vast archaeological site of Chattahook comprises two tells rising up to 20 meters above the Konya Plain on the southern Anatolian Plateau. Excavations of the eastern tell have revealed 18 levels of Neolithic occupation dating from 7400 to 6200 BC that have provided unique evidence of the evolution of prehistoric social organization and cultural practices, illuminating the early adaptation of humans to sedentary life and agriculture. The western tell excavations primarily revealed Chalcolithic occupation levels from 6200 to 5200 BC which reflect the continuation of the cultural practices evident in the earlier eastern mound. Chattahook is a very rare example of a well-preserved Neolithic settlement and has been considered in one of the key sites for understanding human prehistory for some decades. The site is exceptional for its substantial size and great longevity of the settlement, its distinctive layout of back-to-back -back houses with roof access. The presence of a large assemblage of features including wall paintings and reliefs representing the symbolic world of the inhabitants. On the basis of the extensively documented research at the site, the above features make it the most significant human settlement documenting early settled agricultural life of a Neolithic community. Chattahook provides a unique testimony to a moment of the Neolithic in which the first agrarian settlements were established in central Anatolia and developed over centuries from villages to urban centers, largely based on egalitarian principles. The early principles of these settlements have been well preserved through the abandonment of the site for several millennia. These principles can be read in the urban plan, architectural structures, wall paintings and burial evidence. The stratigraphy of up to 18 settlement layers provides an exceptional testimony to the gradual development, reshaping and expansion of the settlement. The house clusters of Chattelhook, characterized by their streetless neighborhoods, dwellings with roof access, and house types representing a highly circumscribed distribution of activity areas and features according to a clear spatial order aligned on cardinal directions, form an outstanding settlement type of the Neolithic period. The comparable sizes of the dwellings throughout the city illustrate an early type of urban layout based on community and egalitarian ideals. The excavated remains of the prehistoric settlement spanning 2,000 years are preserved in situ in good condition, and are completely included in the property boundaries. The two archaeological mounds rise from the surrounding plain and constitute a distinctive landscape feature which has preserved its visual integrity. Shelters constructed above the two main excavation areas protect the archaeological structures from direct effects of the climate and thereby reduce the immediate dangers of rainfall and erosion.